Today is Thursday, October 22nd, 2020. It is an A day. I'm Hannah Rogers, and here is your WCAT news. Let's start off with a few happy birthday wishes to the following who are celebrating their birthdays this week. On Saturday, Brandon Losey. Happy birthday. Attention seniors, please check your email for important ordering information for caps and gowns. Your order week is coming up on October 26th. October 26th to the 30th. Ordering can be done online or you can get a packet from Mrs. Robertson anytime. Please also remember that baby pictures are due this Friday, October 23rd, and senior portraits and candidates are due on October 30th. Envirothon's plastic drive is underway. Boxes are located in the math and science wing outside the relocated Bears Den and by the high school office. Teachers, students, and staff members are welcome to contribute. If you have any questions or are interested in joining Virathon or know of any bulk plastics to donate, feel free to see Mrs. Robertson or Mr. Bragel. The Marcus Whitman High School Drama Club will be holding a drive through chicken barbecue this Friday, October 23rd from 2.30 to 6 p.m. in the high school parking lot slash bus loop. Students, tickets are $10 a meal. Class of 2023, check your Schoology page to vote on our fall 2020 fundraiser. What do you think will help up what do you think will help us raise the most money please place your vote by wednesday at 3 p.m and stay tuned for news on when our fundraiser will start see mr Ayers and mrs mitchell with any questions also don't forget to order your class rings you have until october 30th now here's a look at the weather with earth's online weather center today will be mostly cloudy highs in the lower 60s on friday it will be partly sunny and highs in the mid 70s Attention any students that ordered a yearbook last year and did not receive it. Receive it. Please see your ninth period teacher if you would like to purchase one. There are they are fifty three dollars and are available from Mr. Rowe or Mr. G. Attention high school ski and snowboarders. Please complete the survey posted on Schoology by Friday, October twenty third, regarding ski club for the twenty 2020 twenty and twenty twenty one school year. If you have any questions, see, please see Mrs. Elvord and Mrs. Frank. There will be a fall drive education. There will be a fall driver education class that will begin in November. The class will be taught virtually twice a week from November fourth till January twenty first. The cost the cost will be a hundred dollars. A minimum of ten students is needed to run the class. If you have any questions, please contact Mrs. Mr. Prusinowski. Forms for sign up will be available outside Mr. Prusinowski's room or on Schoology. Attention all current NHS members. Please plan to attend an NHS meeting on Tuesday, October 27th during 10th period in Mr. S's room. We will have a Zoom link in Schoology for those who are virtual. We will be discussing important upcoming NHS activities. Please see Mrs. Minio or Mr. S with questions. Attention all candidates who received a letter home regarding applying to National Honor Society. Remember the mandatory meeting on Wednesday, October 28th during 10th period in Mr. S's room. This meeting will provide you with guidance and the necessary materials needed to apply to National Honor Society. You will receive an email with a Zoom link to the meeting as well. Please see Mr. S or Mrs. Minio with questions. Here are the dress up days for the remainder of the students, Student Council Fall Spirit Weeks. Friday is decade, de Decades Day, dress in your favorite decade. Monday and Tuesday, of next week is pajama day. Wednesday of next week is wildcat day. Thursday of next week, which is a half day, is Halloween dress up. Send photos of your outfits to Mrs. Cooney or any student council member. Here's this week's meeting and events. Finally, this week is National Digital Citizenship Week. Here, here at the high school, we will be having different digital citizenship trivia questions to win some prizes. Here is today's question. List one way you should adjust the privacy settings on your phone to protect your personal information. Students can submit their answers on the Google Forms posted in the high school Schoology page. That's it for today, Wildcats. This has been Hannah Rogers with your WCAT News. Have a great day, and as always, be humble and kind.